The process of merging data allows us to export out Navisworks information, then from that exported information, bring that information into another Navisworks file. Let's go through the entire process of doing those steps. Begin by opening up a Navisworks model. So move the cursor up and select on Open on the Quick Access toolbar. Select on Merge R copy .nwd. Then click on Open. This is our copy of this merge project. The next thing we need to do is create a new viewpoint of an area that we wish to do a markup of. Over on the right hand side, you can see that I have saved viewpoints. And if you have saved viewpoints, you do not need to do this next step. But if you cannot find your saved viewpoints, start by looking on either the left hand side or on the right hand side for these tabs and see if saved viewpoints is there. If it is, click on the tab and you'll have access to this information. If not, come up to the View tab on the ribbon, click on Windows, and put a check next to Saved Viewpoints. This will open up the saved viewpoints and you will be able to do the next step. From here, click the little plus next to Walk, then double click where it has Frame 0001. This opens up one of the frames inside of an animation. I don't want to make a markup to this frame, but I do want to do a markup of this view. So to do this, move the cursor over and minimize where it has walk. So click on the little minus sign, right click here in the white area, and save viewpoint. Let's call this merge info. Now click somewhere here inside of our viewing area. Double click where it has the merge info. This activates this viewpoint. Come up to review and select on text. You will see this pencil tool. To the right of the door, click right in this area. Enter red line text. This is asking for us to type in a piece of text, some information that we're trying to communicate to someone else. Type in revise door and click on OK. This is the information that we want to export out and give to somebody else. Just to see that this is part of this viewpoint, double click where it has Abby and it opens up a different view. Now click where it has Merge Info, and we can see that the text is still there. To save this out as a merge piece of information, we now need to come up here to the big N, which is the Applications button, do a Save As. Make sure that this says NWF. If it currently says NWD, click where this line is at next to Save As Type, and then change it to Navisworks File Set in NWF. For the name, export our copy dot nwf and click on save. The next thing I'd like to do is open up the other copy of this file. And we can do that by coming up here to the end, coming to open, changing this from an nwf file to an nwd file, and select on merge their copy and click on open. Now if we had sent that NWF file to whoever the other person is, they can now bring that information into their copy of the file. To do that and to see how this works, the next thing we need to do is move our cursor to the Home tab, click on Home, select where the word Append is at, and then click Merge. Now we need to pick that piece of information that we want to merge into this project. Change this from navisworks.nwd to Navisworks file set nwf. Select on our export rcopy.nwf, then click on open. We can see that for the save viewpoints, we now have merge info. And if we click on merge info, now inside of their file, they can now see 
are markups, such as this revised door. But that's actually not the only thing that got transferred over. Another thing that was transferred in, or actually merged in, was the viewport itself. So this is the same viewpoint that was inside of the other project, and it's been brought into their file so that they now have our markup information so that they can make changes to the appropriate files to update the Navisworks model.